my boyfriend this month, so I need to get him when I need to get him. Don't y'all tell me when I need to get him. Don't you worry about it. Because a pimp like me don't need nothing but one client. That's one client, one million dollars. That's exactly what I charge to get a haircut. I know y'all hating on me right now. Talking about I done been cut hair all day. And I done made some money, but I have not made one million dollars. And yep, I got to tell you, only person that's going to have fun is Cat Williams. So I'm going to tell you right now. Don't, don't you, I know you my client, but you ain't got to interrupt me. It's pops. Uh, first of all, <laughs> thank you. Mm-hmm. I need to get my haircut. Been waiting here the last hour and a half. Make no sense. Uh, you get my haircut. Fucking run down the street. With all the nice kitty pies. Looking all fresh. Yeah, boy. Nah, uh, sir, that is not the way you talk to a pimp. I get here when I feel like it. That's what happened. I keep on doing that. I'm going to have to go to Plies over here and get my hair cut. It's Plies. First of all, <laughs> if you think <laughs> I'm going to cut your hair, <laughs> just whenever you tell me, whenever you feel like it, <laughs> you got another mother freaking thing coming to us all the time, the mother freaking thing. I swear, it's absolutely too much going on in this barbershop. I'm about to get my, I need to get some fresh hair. Uncle Ross is by the door. I'm going to tell you right now. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna say that. But I got to tell you, when I first signed up for this job, when I was on live, I thought a white man was the owner. That was the reason that I wanted to come in. But I gotta tell you, this young black man over here, he doing his thing. I'm gonna stop right there. Later.